I'm going to show you how to use our website and replay media catcher to record slacker.com. First of all, I'm on our homepage and I'm in Firefox and um, our homepage is www.applying.com and I'm using this recording tool on our homepage and I'm just typing in slacker.com. How do I record it? And it's letting me know that Replay Media Catcher is the recommended product for Slacker.com. And it's also giving me some pretty precise instructions about make sure to capture H uncheck capture HTTP streams and check the web stream dumper under the settings when capturing from Slacker. So let me minimize the screen. Let me open Replay Media Catcher. Would I like to start recording now? I'm going to say no because first I want to adjust my settings. So I go Tools, Settings. It brings up the Replay Media Catcher settings. I'm going to uncheck Capture HTTP Media Streams and check Web Stream Dumper and then click Close. Now I'm going to click Start Recording. And then I'm going back to Firefox and I'm going to type in slacker.com. It's loading Slacker Radio. It's asking me to pick um, a top station. I'm just going to put click on today's hits as you can see it started to play replay media catcher has captured it oh and tagged it and I am going to just let it keep going and we'll come back in a little bit hey I'm back and I'm going to stop recording uh, so I'm gonna click stop recording here you can see Replay uh, Media Catcher got a ton of songs. Here, I'm trying to scroll up. It wasn't able to tag all of them, but it's super easy to go back in and re-tag the songs. You just right-click and go to Rename and or Edit Tag Info. And let me just show you how this works. So if I want to play one, like the Coldplay, I just double-click on it. It says Play Media and it brings up and that's all there is to it so pretty easy it was also um, kinda cool I didn't have to interact with uh, slacker.com at all I didn't log in all I did was go to the site and play one of the radio stations and uh, while I had replay media catcher recording in the background so um, pretty simple anyway if you have any questions you can always go to the applyin.com site w.applyin.com and uh, go to support and product technical support and you'll find all the answers you need or in the discussion forums have fun bye